Hello, so I thought I would do another vlog, another moving vlog because I uploaded my second one yesterday and so many of you seem to really be liking the moving vlog so I'm going to do another one over this weekend as well and it's a long weekend because it's bank holiday Monday so we've got Saturday, Sunday and Monday so yeah I'm going to vlog as much as I can. We stayed here for the first time last night which was really really nice and although we don't have any curtains yet so we did get woken up when it got light at like 5am because suddenly it was like really bright but yeah we need to get some curtains yes but apart from that it was very nice to stay here for the first time this is our bed I nearly said little bed I don't know what it is about me but in these vlogs I've realised I have this weird thing where I say little before everything like everything is described as little even if it's bloody huge and it's so weird because I'm so unaware I'm doing it so yeah thanks for bringing that to my attention guys I'm now going to make sure I don't do it because it's a little bit strange no that's okay though a little bit strange that's fine it's the way I describe every object as little like I'll be like oh here's the little bed but it's not little it's a flipping king size bed here is our bed and as you can see we don't have an iron um I never used to iron my bedding back at home because I'm lazy and I was hoping I could continue that here but this new bedding creases so much like look at that but yeah I've just got two little uh, two cushions <laughs> it's actually a problem a little no <laughs> I'm not even doing it on purpose help me what is wrong so alex is just outside so i'm thinking maybe i should scare him when he walks back in i think that sounds like a good idea <laughs> oh you scared me <laughs> i literally just jumped in the air didn't I? oh yeah we've got these little temporary chairs until our sofa arrives in case you're thinking why are there some random wooden chairs you're wearing baggy jeans far more comfortable you haven't seen the new addition to our family yet. I really liked the kettle and toaster, so I got a matching bin. And we need to get some batteries, and then it's like one of those ones that you wave your hand and then it opens like magic. Very exciting. And then, yeah, I didn't stop there. Also got a matching bread bin thingy. How was your first sleep in our house? It was alright. <laughs> I was asleep for most of it, so I didn't really know what I was doing. Oh, no, no, no. There is someone very attractive stood behind you. You know when you have that hot friend, so when you're next to them you look ugly? Oh, yeah. That's what you look like when you're stood next to my bin. I'm joking, but I mean, come on. Oh, we didn't get batteries! Oh, no. So whilst I was clearing out my room, I found my Nintendo. And I just thought for anyone else that was born back in my era, <laughs> that makes me sound so old. But you know, anyone who's like a similar age to me, this will be really like nostalgic. Just, just listen. Ready? <laughs> Is that not just the sound of your childhood? And in here, I mean, I feel like anyone who had a Nintendo probably had this <laughs> and by the way i completed the whole thing just to point that out what was it you said to me yesterday you, you like said something to me alex said to me he was like oh i remember you were very good at uh, super mario on the nintendo weren't you and then like five minutes later i was like you know when you said that to me i felt so happy inside <laughs> wrong way <laughs> this was the greatest game oh 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 god help 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 uh. anyway okay so i am about to change my knobs on this little on this big what's it called tv stand thing i got copper knobs of course i mean if i could have any kind of knob it would be a copper one and um these are like oh, i don't know if you'll be able to see focus on my knob please come on there we go i think you're focused so i'm gonna add this i've got <clears throat> dropping my knobs i've got three of them obviously yeah i'm gonna try and do this myself alex is upstairs on the phone to his grandma blessing so i'm gonna try and do it myself because i don't want to wait till he gets back because i'm just impatient inserting my knob <laughs> gently it's in that was easy <laughs> and then i just screw the is this a nut wait so we've got nuts and knobs <laughs> how unfortunate i think this is called a nut <laughs> There we go. Call me Bob the Builder. I have just managed to 
changed my knobs successfully. <gasps> it looks so much cuter now. Like, I, oh my goodness, that just changes that so much, doesn't it? It goes from like a typical Ikea piece to something that looks so much more expensive and all I did was change a knob. Change your knob? It wasn't your knob. Change the knobs. I don't know why there are so many nuts left though. They gave me free nuts. <laughs> And not the edible kind, which is good because I don't like those. I'm literally having to squint. I'm just not feeling it. I really just want it to be autumn and winter now. I've, I don't like summer that... What is going on? I don't like summer that much. I just... I'm not a huge fan of like hot weather. Like I don't mind it when it's sunny, but I just don't like it when it's hot. <sighs> I love it so much. Oh my God, I'm actually so happy with that. But yeah, there's nothing new in here because we're just waiting for furniture to arrive, really. There's a couple of things we can build here today, but we need to go and get a screwdriver. So I think we're gonna go and do that. Yes. I like you, Derek. He likes Derek. I like you very much. <laughs> very much. Yeah, I think next door we're moving in soon. And uh, uh well, it, they're basically building Watch yourself on my baby I'm so excited for when I can start like filling up the wardrobe with my clothes and stuff and just like proper getting everything in because most of it's still at my family house. I think next week I'm going to focus on bringing as much stuff down as I can. You can tell how warm I am, I look. <sighs> but yeah, I did film something the other day whilst I was back at home because I basically spent one of the days clearing out my wardrobe and just sort of like deciding what I wanted to keep and what I wanted to get rid of. And I did film that, but I wasn't going to use it because I felt like it was all a bit boring. But I might just like slot it in here just because I honestly got rid of so much stuff. Like I'd say I almost half my wardrobe, which is pretty impressive. So yeah, I need to have that here if you want to watch it. If not, no hard feelings, I understand. You probably don't want to see me sort through my clothing. Oi, I've got the brother in the room. You can kind of see you in the mirror. Oh. Today I am back at home. Well, I have two homes now. Back at the fam's home and I'm in my room because I need to like pack up my room. Yeah, I need to go through my wardrobe and get rid of a load of stuff because it's just an absolute mess. I'll show you in a minute if you really want to see. He still hasn't seen it. The brother has not seen the house yet. Mum and dad have seen it. it. Yeah, and he's the one that picked it. Oh, yeah. He's the one that actually found it. I'm really bright. You aren't, Toby. <laughs> That's so funny. <gasps> You're so pretty. Why are you so pretty? I actually wish I was as pretty as you, honestly. You're the best cat in the world. And soon I won't live with you anymore. <laughs> What are we going to do? You better come and visit, like honestly, you're better. You better pop down for the day. <laughs> Anyway, I've just opened my doors and this is my wardrobe. <laughs> I'm so bad at keeping it tidy and there's also a bit down there. Th this bit's tidy. They stay in these little baskets. I'm actually going to miss this wardrobe. It is a really nice wardrobe, but obviously we've got like the built-in wardrobe now. So there's no point bringing this. There'd be no space for it. But yeah, I think I'm just going to take out as much stuff as I can and put it into piles of things I'm going to keep, things that I'm going to take to charity. Ch charity and then i might if there are any things that i think you guys might like i might just put them in a, a separate pile and potentially put them on my depop because i did do that before <sighs> let's go okay so this is literally just like hoodies jumpers coats and then like jeans and dungarees and stuff very pale in this lighting like i know i am pale but i look very very unwell pale uh this next section is a lot easier it's like shorts and trousers and stuff like that there's like hardly anything from this shorts trousers this should be pretty easy <gasps> hang on a minute <gasps> oh my god oh my goodness that makes me so excited for winter i can't get rid of any of these like primark christmas leggings are the best things ever oh my god i'm so excited for christmas now it's time to tackle the main bit of the wardrobe. <sighs> How did I manage to buy so many clothes without realising I dumped them in here and I never really like properly evaluate how many I have and now I'm like, oh. Oh my good, oh no, stay. Oh. That was a bad move. I could start a hanger shop here. I honestly could. Look at my new 
clothing collection. I've definitely downsized it. I've got uh, blah, 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 like jogging bottoms, shorts and trousers. I've got jeans and dungarees. I've got, wait, what's that? Dresses and play suits, t-shirts, shirts, like pretty tops, I guess, crop tops, jumpers, sweatshirts, cardigans, and two Christmas jumpers. These are all the things that I'm gonna either take to charity or sell on Depop if I'm not feeling too lazy. That is it really. Sorry today was just filled with times, times, <laughs> time lapses and clothes, but that's literally all I've done. Bye. So I thought I'd done a really good job and done them right. Um, well, they're not wrong. But they are because the you're redoing them. Quite in the, right place. the washer. I just saw knobs and nuts. Like, what are you chatting about? Oh, Basically, yeah. I forgot to put this bit on this side. They are nice. Yeah. They are the nice. Is it the nicest knob you've ever seen? <laughs> Do you want to come with us to buy a screwdriver? I mean, <laughs> who wouldn't? Dude, Can slow. you watch my Snapchats? Does anybody else send their boyfriend or girlfriend or whoever? Just a load of weird snapshots in a row. And then when Alex opens them, I make him do it with me around so I can rewatch them. Like, I'm in hysterics doing them. Like, they make me laugh more than they make you laugh, don't they? Mm-hmm, usually. <laughs> Where's, I've lost a sock in all of this action. Like, actually, what? It. Can you get up? <laughs> Alex, what the hell? What? I've got it. Yeah, you do! Oh, you got your sock. <laughs> you do. What would I do with your sock? Can I have my sock, please? I've got your sock. <laughs> like, there's nowhere it could have travelled to. Does this house have a sock grabber somewhere? Maybe. <laughs> Check the ceiling. <laughs> oh! The phantom sock grabber. Maybe. I don't know where your sock is. Oh my god, you actually don't have it! I told you! Oh, I'm tripping, I'm, I'm tripping. not lying. Whoa! He Call actually, me a liar. He actually, wait, what? He actually doesn't have my sock. Of course, does beg the question, where is your sock? What the hell? <laughs> oh, I think it's in my shoe. Oh, you... Oh yeah, because I, I put the shoe on it. <laughs> the phantom sock feeler isn't... Feel... <laughs> <laughs> Phantom sock stealer doesn't exist. I should really not do that when it's right on the edge. Would you like to buy a screw now, driver? <laughs> I'm not your driver. Would you like to buy a screwdriver now? Yes. Oh, please. I'm at that point where I'm like so sleepy that I'm just really hyper. Oh, get your baggies away from me. <laughs> anyway, I do have an awful laugh sometimes. It's a dragonfly. Did you see the size of that? Yeah, it's quite large. It's not really about that big. <laughs> dragonfly, my ass. I'm thinking that was a dragon. Like, dragon full stop. I think it might have been a dragon flop. <laughs> <laughs> I've never seen a bug that big. Like, that was borderline mammal. I hope you enjoyed that. That was pure terror. I thought that we were under attack from a pterodactyl. Mm. That would have been good though, because that was one of my favourite dinosaurs back in the day. I used to quite like dinosaurs when I was younger. And I liked pterodactyls and diplodocus. We're going to build a bedside table. A bedside table. But so that we've got two, because at the moment we've only got one. That's two. One. We've got some stubby screws. Screwdrivers. We've done it. We have built the bedside table. Got a spare bit. We've got a spare nubbin. If you would like this nubbin, contact me and I'll send it to you. I actually will. Um, <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm in my little 
office room right now and I'm just thinking how to like fill the space a bit and to make like a nice background because obviously that's not going to be there it's going to be round here with my desk I kind of need to fill the space a bit to make a background and just so it's not so echoey and this is what I've got my eye on and I just can't stop looking at it but it's a little bit expensive but look at it <gasps> I mean okay for a sofa it's actually not that bad but at the same time I just oh I don't know do I get it I feel like it will look so cute just like here it's happening I'm getting the sofa bye Alex yes what's up I bought the unnecessary sofa S Sophie Louise and the unnecessary sofa <laughs> Coming to a cinema near you. Not for a blooming long time. No, Do you know when? Really? No, when? Like, I think it said it would the earliest it would come is the 8th of September. Quite a while that's actually. Like, that's two weeks. Oh, it's only two weeks. September feels like a long way away, but it's actually not. Yeah. Is is that a bad choice that I did that? I think not, because I think I'll always be happy when I look at it. Whee! <laughs> Why are we leaving him in charge? Alex is doing dinner tonight and it's the first time my pans are being used. I hope you're enjoying this. So we've got some veggies bubbling. Are they nice pans? Uh, they do the job. Yeah. Grand. Tick the boxes is what they do. Hallelujah. And they look fabulous. What do they look? Fabulous. So dinner is now ready. It looks very nice. I've got pie, which is my absolute favorite thing in the world, and some vegetables. Alex has got like a blooming platted pie, you know. We've also got some garlic bread here, mm -hmm. which I also love. This is like a lot of my favorite things. Oh, fantastic. Oh, thanks, mate. Shall, shall we eat our dinner? Oh, yeah, oh, thanks, mate. Oh, thanks, mate. Oh, thanks, mate. Yeah, man. Thank oh, oh, thanks. Oh, thanks, mate. <laughs> dinner time. <laughs> I said this is just such an Alex way to fall asleep. Oh, and now he'll just continue playing. <laughs> Did you have a nice sleep with your guitar? You technically cheated on me with your guitar. Mm -hmm. We're now in bed and we're gonna go to sleep. We're gonna try and go to sleep a little bit earlier because we're gonna be woken up at like five o'clock again. Because we didn't get a curtain, but we're gonna try and get a curtain tomorrow. Uh, <laughs> and we'll sleep better tonight. So I barely slept at all last night, but I feel like I've gone strong today. I think because I'm used to it because I don't sleep very much in general. I'm fine, but Alex is so bad. He'll be like, oh, I only got like six hours sleep. And I'm like, well, that's a good night for me. <laughs> Bring you go out and get some curtains. And... Yeah, but I think that'll be tomorrow. So that'll be in the next order, vlog. Order a TV. Yes, I think we might go TV shopping tomorrow as well. So the whoop, next, whoop. you can tell he's had wine. See you in the next vlog for TV and curtain shopping and maybe building my Billy bookcase. I came up really. <laughs> My Billy bookcase. <laughs> it's called the Billy bookcase, by the way. I haven't named my bookcase Billy. Wouldn't put it past me, but it's what the IKEA people called it, but I promise. Anyway, mm. I hope that you enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you want more moving vlogs. Just let me know. I don't want you getting bored of them. If you are, I'll stop. Good night. Good night. Good night.